Okay, I'll show you something really weird. I didn't film this with a screen capture program because I'm going to show you a printer later in the room and I didn't want to have any edits in this that would be suspect. So this is going to be one continuous segment, as bad as it might be. And I know you can't see the screen that well, but that's okay for now. Uh, what you see here is a shortcut to a spreadsheet. So let's go ahead and open up a spreadsheet and we'll go into a cell on this spreadsheet and it doesn't really matter which cell we'll just pick one that's on the screen and I'll say one two three okay then I'll go up to the top to the colors and I will make that red okay now I'm going to go over here and I'm gonna say file save as and I have a temporary folder set up. I'm going to get out of this directory because that's where my real spreadsheet is. And I don't want to screw that up. And I'll say save. And it already exists. Do you want to overwrite it? Yes, overwrite it. No problem. Okay, now here's the weird part. <clears throat> now I'm going to go down here into my printers and I have some printers set up on this computer one of which is the HP DeskJet 4200 series in this case it's the F4280 this is now not the default printer but let's make it the default printer okay so now the HP DeskJet F4280 is my default printer. Now back to the spreadsheet. Let's go back here and we'll go to the cell right underneath this. These are formatted as currency cells but it doesn't really matter. Uh, any what happened? doesn't really matter. So one, two, three and now I'm going to go to the top and I'm going to make it red <clears throat> and now we'll zoom out again and now I'm going to say file save as and I'm back here in my temp directory and I'm going to say save overwrite and say yes and boom crash okay so now I don't send, I never send these, I don't think they pay attention to it. <clears throat> Let's see what's happened. Let's go back to that same shortcut. And we can see that the first entry we made is still there. But the second entry that we made after setting the default printer to the HP is gone. All, all your work will be gone, <laughs> depending on how hard you work. The weird part is I wasn't even printing. I was only trying to save the file on Excel. As long as the HP DeskJet F4280 is set as the default printer, I cannot save an Excel spreadsheet if I, if I alter the fonts. If I use the default fonts, it's okay. But if I make the font red or bold or put a comment in there with a font that's a different point size, it'll crash. Like I said, I'm not even printing. I'm not even printing. Now, I can reproduce this over and over and over and over again. There's no trick photography here. This, the HP DeskJet F4280 will cause my Excel spreadsheet to crash if I put in a red font or any kind of a special font, not even printing it, just saving the file. How weird is that? That's not the, even the weirdest part. I can use the printer successfully with Word. I can use it with Notepad. I can even go into Photoshop. I've done it and I can print color pictures, edit them. Everything is fine, but it interferes with the Excel spreadsheet. Now, here's the printer that we're talking about right here. I just bought this thing. I had a, a, bro, a Canon printer here before in the same location hooked up to the same print server no problem everything worked fine I just got this printer and I just started having this problem okay 
installed from the disc that came with the printer had this problem. So now you say, oh, go get their newest drivers. I went to their website, got their newest drivers, installed it, same problem. Didn't help. On the internet, you'll find people that are having similar issues with Excel and this printer. It, it won't print their spreadsheets. Oddly enough, I tried to print the spreadsheet and it worked, but I can't save the spreadsheet. Now, I can take the printer and I can delete it from my list of printers and the spreadsheet works fine. <clears throat> I can change it so that it's not the default printer as you just saw and the spreadsheet will work fine. As soon as I set the, that up as the default printer, I can't save my spreadsheet with any kind of fonts other than the default fonts that are on that spreadsheet. Something very weird with this HP printer. Something very weird with HP. They're not copying to it. You go to their website, they have a, a list of known issues, and that's not on there. I would really be leery of, uh, it's a reputable company, so I'm really surprised that they have this issue, but I'm telling you, I can reproduce this problem over and over and over and over again. That's why I'm making this video, because I knew I could do it. So there you have it. HP 42, uh, DeskJet F4280 crashes your Excel um, spreadsheets.